Hey guys, welcome to our video. Today, we will talk about Australia as an aeronautical engineer with visa sponsorship. If you are interested in this topic, please watch till the end of this video. Immigrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer. Every occupation on the MLTSSL and STSOL is assigned an immigration code, and the code for those looking to migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer is 233,911. This is also known as the NZSCO code for an aeronautical engineer. According to the NZSCO classification schedule, the code for aeronautical engineer contains the following migration groups and subgroups. Major group 2, professionals. Sub-major group 23, design, engineering, science, and transport professionals. Minor group 233, engineering professionals. Unit group 2339, other engineering professionals. This unit group covers engineering professionals not elsewhere classified. It includes aeronautical engineers, agricultural engineers, biomedical engineers, engineering technologists, environmental engineers, and naval architects, OS or marine designers, NZ. Tasks for aeronautical engineers include preparing designs for aeronautical process systems and planning control systems for processes such as those used to remove and separate components, affect aeronautical changes, test and evaluate fuels, transfer heat, and control the storing and handling of solids, liquids, and gases. Monitoring the operation and maintenance of equipment to achieve maximum efficiency under safe operating conditions. Ensuring correct materials and equipment are used and that they conform to specifications. Diagnosing malfunctions in aeronautical plants and instituting remedial action. Studying product utilization and pollution control problems. Reviewing plans for new products and submitting material selection recommendations in accordance with design specifications and factors such as strength, weight, and cost. Planning and implementing laboratory operations to develop new materials and fabrication procedures for new materials to fulfill production costs and performance standards. Conferring with producers of materials, such as metals, ceramics, polymers, cements, and elastomers during the investigation and evaluation of materials suitable for specific product applications. Reviewing product failure data and implementing laboratory tests to establish or reject possible causes and advising on ways to overcome any problems. Minimum qualifications required to migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer. According to ANZSCO, those looking to emigrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer must demonstrate qualifications equivalent to a bachelor degree or higher qualification. In some instances, relevant experience and slash or on-the-job training may be required in addition to the formal qualification. Minimum work experience to migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer. Generally, we'll be looking for you to have over three years experience. What is the process to migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer? Once you've satisfied a NZSCO and calculated a minimum of 65 immigration points, it's time to start looking at getting your migration case underway. Let's Go Global have a 100% success rate with those in the aeronautical engineering category looking to migrate to Australia. Migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer qualifications assessment. Every occupation, trade, and profession have their own skills assessment body. It's their job to say that you are who you say you are and that you have the right skills, experience, and qualifications. In the case of a NZSCO code 233911, the Australian Skills Assessment Body for Aeronautical Engineer is Engineers Australia. Stage 1. Skills Assessment, Training, Qualification, and Employment Check, Aeronautical Engineering. Stage 1 is the collation of a decision-ready bundle of documents which can be used by the assessment body to evidence and substantiate your skills, training, qualifications, and experience. Emigrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer stage 2 formal application. The final stage of your migration to Australia as an aeronautical engineer is your formal application to the Department of Home Affairs after receiving an invitation to apply. At this stage, police checks and medicals are required. What Australia visas are available for an aeronautical engineer to emigrate to Australia? The main skilled visa classes of 189 and 190 bring what's termed permanent residency status from day one. Permanent residency for an aeronautical engineer means you'll be able to live and work in Australia, enter and leave without the need for further visas. 
Access Medicare. Access education for children without contribution. Access financial services. Own property. Sponsor other eligible family members after two years. Apply for full citizenship and dual nationality after four years. Can my family join me on a skilled visa? Yes, with the added bonus that your partner may not even need to do a skills assessment in their own right for whatever occupation they hold. The rights and privileges afforded to the main visa holder are passed on to partners and children automatically. Employer-sponsored visas to emigrate to Australia as an Aeronautical Engineer Australia. Aeronautical Engineer is on the MLTSSL for Australia, which means it's eligible for the TSS employer-sponsored visa, and whilst this visa is initially classed as temporary, it can convert to fill permanent residency status after three years. Occupation Ceilings for Aeronautical Engineer Australia Migration Occupation ceilings dictate how many skilled visas are issued to applicants in a particular year. For 2023, the occupation ceiling for aeronautical engineer immigrating to Australia is 1,000. 190 state nomination for aeronautical engineers. The following Australian states and territories currently offer their weight to the 190 visa class for aeronautical engineers emigrating to Australia. NSW New South Wales. ESSA South Australia. QLD Queensland, VIC Victoria, and T Northern Territory, WA Western Australia, a CT Australian Capital Territory. Do I need a job to migrate to Australia as an aeronautical engineer? Not usually. The 189 visa class does not require a formal job offer, although some states and territories do require this for the 190 subclass. Jobs in Australia for Aeronautical Engineers. The job market in Australia for aeronautical engineers remains constant and is expected to do so for the next five years. Most engineers in Australia are employed on a full-time basis. Unemployment for qualified aeronautical engineers in Australia is below average. Average salary in Australia for an aeronautical engineer. Average salary for aeronautical engineer in Australia is $1,990 per week or $103,552 per year.